Hi there, beautiful soul. So in the past year, I've had a lot of coaching sessions with many people who have a chronic condition like MECFS, but also people with other conditions. And more and more am I able to find the root cause behind every, well, complaint that I've discovered so far. And it also makes it really clear on what to do next. So come with me for an adventure. And please have an open mind because it might not be what you expect to be. I have found out that almost everybody that I talk to has some of the following belief systems in their system. Being unworthy, being unlovable, feeling unseen and feeling unheard. And this might be a very big aspect of you, but it might also be a very small aspect of you. And it might be conscious or it might be unconscious. As soon as you feel this, you automatically feel drawn to compensate this. And you're trying to find what you're actually needing outside of yourself. And then you can engage yourself in what I call a coping mechanism. A coping mechanism is always a behavior that is stressful and it represents fight or flight. Fight or flight from what? From the feeling. So it adds stress to your so-called stress bucket. But whatever you do, the feeling that you would like to have will never be accomplished. That is because the feelings that you run away from by using fight or flight are inside of yourself. And therefore you can't outrun yourself. You can't fight or fight yourself any longer. That's when people usually will have a chronic disease. So instead of acting from these belief systems, it is wise to just sit with it and embrace the feelings. Now, almost everything that I found out in this healing journey is that is always a reverse then. Because for the first time, when you don't run away from yourself, you can hear yourself. You can see yourself and you can start to love what your body is communicating or what your soul is communicating. And that is what we call worthiness because you see yourself. So the solution is not outside of yourself, but it's inside of yourself. And it's not the things that you have been done and been doing in the past is the exact opposite. And therefore it's not a journey further away from yourself but it is the journey back to yourself so hear yourself what are the whispers of your souls and maybe in a chronic disease what are the screams of your souls in your body what is it screaming to you can you listen to it can you hear yourself can you see yourself and by not resisting the symptoms you actually start to love yourself and you treat yourself as if you're worthy. And that is a massive stress release. It's, it's unimaginable. And of course, there are a lot of emotions as well that you need to hear and listen to. And that will be as well a stress release when that comes out. I think it will come out automatically because life sort of wants you to heal. So therefore you are deleting belief systems you stop coping behavior. You stop the suppressing of negative emotions that are a consequence of that. And your body becomes lighter. And that will drastically change your life. So how to do all these things? You can start by following the alignment recovery program that you can follow for uh, a donation via my website, danielvanloosbroek.com. There are a lot of great tools and tips there. There's also a Facebook community. And as everything that I do is like even my podcast and stuff is for free. I do it everything via donation. So if you would like to support me back in this healing journey where we are healing differently, then I'll, uh, consider making a donation and help me. But um, yeah, for now, I wish you a beautiful day. Thanks for watching. Bye.